Good morning, everyone. I wanted to get a video out today while uh, I'm here getting unloaded finally. You know, doing what uh, truck drivers do, hurry up and wait. Uh, anyway, uh, I want to take a quick moment first, though, to thank everyone who has been watching the videos, subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. It's been crazy how quickly it's been growing. It's great. I hope we keep it up. So uh, I think like 97% of people who watch this uh, are not subscribed. So, you know, hopefully you'll change your mind. Uh, subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. I want to grow a little community here uh, to do things like this. I want to um, ask you guys some questions. I noticed some crazy, crazy stuff happening here in the Midwest uh, with fuel prices. And I wanted to see if it's just me or just my company or you know, the carrier or if it's, you know, happening to everyone else out there, or if it's sort of like a trickle effect, um, which is sort of what I'm thinking it is. But uh, I was making a, working on a video for the fuel economy that I get in this truck, and I, since I don't have the computers and stuff that a lot of the newer trucks have, I'm thinking the only way I can do it is to um, fill the tanks and then, you know, do the receipts and the math and the miles and the odometers and all that stuff to show you guys um, what I'm getting uh, but you know if someone wants to donate 220 gallons of fuel to the to the cause you know just to try to prove me wrong or something yeah, by all means uh, I'll, I'll leave my cash app in the in the description below I'm joking I won't but hey if anyone wants to do it but I'm working on that how I'm gonna do it but in doing that um, you know a lot of us owner operators were leased to a carrier because well, one of the reasons is like contract freight can be really good, especially right now with uh, the spot market the way it is and the fuel discounts that you get with um, being leased on. Uh, and I had been for the last several months been getting anywhere between 70 and 80 cents off a gallon, which has been fantastic. Uh, so it's been just under five bucks a gallon for me, which is still not good, you know, a couple years ago versus now. But I know it's a little bit better here than it is, you know, out west and out east. Uh, even down south, honestly, I think I've seen Florida is not very good either. But um, it finally now hit six bucks a gallon here in Ohio, which I know it's been like in Pennsylvania, it's been six bucks. Out east, it's been six bucks and plus for a while. So I know you guys are hurting more out there than we are here. But um, what I noticed yesterday was... I use a fuel book app to see what the discounts are in different places and there are no more discounts that <clears throat> truck stops just stopped giving them apparently from what, I, from what I heard I reached out to Great Wide which is where I'm leased on to and they said it has to do with the price that they are paying uh, the fuel stops are paying versus the, the margin or whatever so that there's less profit there so they can't offer a discount anymore but we haven't lost our discount but i mean if that were true i wouldn't think every single truck stop would um would do that of course i'm above my pay grade as to why a lot of this is what it is um i know some stuff to do with union pacific uh, and pilot and specifically not being able to order as much fuel as they used to um but I wanted to, I reached out to a friend of mine who uh, is leased on to Mercer. He still gets a little bit of a discount where he is, but he looked here as well and there was no discount for him here. So I don't know if it's like a regional type deal or if it's just moving on through, but I wanted to see what you guys are experiencing. Um, is it the same for you and anyone else that's leased on? I don't, I don't know if there's any like Landstar I know has a good, good discounts. So I wanted to see if you guys are still getting those. I know other owner operators, especially if you're out with your own authority, you're hurting real bad right now. So I don't know what, what we're going to do. I mean, I know it's a cyclical thing, you know, and uh, eventually, hopefully, it'll get better. Uh, we just got to get through this, this coming into high fuel price season in the summer. But uh, yeah, I wanted to see if anyone else is out there experiencing the same thing. I just noticed it yesterday to where no more fuel discounts. So five bucks a gallon is now six bucks a gallon overnight. And uh, that hurts. That hurts pretty bad. But, you know, let me know what you guys are seeing out there. If uh, different carriers you may be leased on to. I know company drivers don't got to worry about it. 
but any other any other owner operators out there going through the same thing uh see if what's going on i don't know what else to do um mom and pop shops are usually a little bit cheaper so i think we're going to stop going to the the bigger ones for now uh thinking about i know the mud flap app is uh I've heard that they might not be getting discounts right now either. Uh, other than that, I'm thinking like cash back credit card. I don't know. Uh, but then I have to send them a fuel receipt so they can take care of the IFTA. But anyway, I just wanted to reach out to you guys. As I know there's more experienced owner operators out there that might have uh, different insights. And I wanted to see what everyone else is going through. So again, thank everyone. Thank you for subscribing to the channel for liking the videos for watching the videos i appreciate it i uh, plan on making some more doing some other types of stuff um so stay tuned and uh hold on we're gonna get through all this crap i'll see you guys be safe see ya